For the full article on today's video, be sure to check out pixelade.info. Hey guys, what's up? It's Pixelade here and welcome back to another Sims 4 news and info video. This one's going up just a few hours late and only because I don't want to spam the crap out of you guys with videos. I'd rather give you maybe two or three hours between each one so that you don't get on YouTube and see 8 million videos that you have to watch because I know that annoys some of you. So I'm trying my best to space them out, but not space them out too much to where, you know, you don't even feel like watching the video anymore because you already know all the news. So this next video is going to be about the press release for The Sims 4 Get Famous. So without further ado, let's jump on in. Electronic Arts Incorporation and Maxis today announced The Sims 4 Get Famous expansion pack is coming to PC and Mac on November 16th. With the brand new expansion, players will have the chance to live out their wildest dreams of lavish fame and rags to riches fortune as their Sims become A-list celebrities, experiencing all of the luxurious thrills along the rise to superstardom. In The Sims 4 Get Famous, Sims can launch into celebrity status with an all-new acting career, which is a exactly what I was expecting. I had a feeling that we weren't going to get tons of careers, so I'm pretty sure that it's just acting and I'm pretty sure that EA is going to be focusing on acting. In a way, it's kind of a bad thing because I really wanted singing to be in this, but if it's just acting, that usually means that it's very, very detailed, which means that they really put all the attention into one thing. And I'm hoping that we get that with this pack, and maybe in the future we get one that's strictly dedicated to singing. That would be really cool too. EA posts they can catch their big break through a standout audition landing a role in a television series or commercial gig. Aspiring Sims who go the extra mile by both looking the part and studying lines can take their career to the next level with a starring role in the next big blockbuster. Sims can also bask in the limelight as an inspiring influencer, live streaming every lavish moment and giving other Sims maximum FOMO, or even by gaining worldwide acclaim in their current career. No no matter a sim's claim to fame, they'll be able to attend exclusive parties with stars, outrun starstruck fans, truly experience the VIP lifestyle of their dreams and more. So there's a lot more in this one that actually was different from the blog post that I uploaded in my last video. You can run from paparazzi and from starstruck fans. That is really, really cool. So I'm guessing the level of fame in this gets really, really big. And I can't wait to see exactly how famous your Sims can get. In The Sims 3, with late night and the showtime aspect, fame really didn't seem like fame. It just felt like three or four Sims were following you around. With this, I hope it's more. I hope it's literally dozens and dozens of people at a time to where it gets annoying. Because if it gets annoying, that means that your Sim is truly famous because that's probably what it feels like in real life it needs to be realistic that's how i see it what do you guys think do you feel like it should be realistic in that aspect having lots of paparazzi having lots of fans i feel like that would really really bring out the fun in this expansion pack also another thing i noticed in this paragraph is it says worldwide acclaim so are there critics do you have like a rotten tomato score a metacritic score that would be really cool if the projects that you partake in get critical acclaim or could be critically panned i'm really hoping that they made it so that critics can either positively Positively or negatively affect your commercial career. The Sims team continues to quote, with The Sims 4 Get Famous, players can achieve their wildest dreams of becoming a celebrity and all the perks that come with fame in The Sims 4. From rubbing elbows with A-list celebrities at the studio to star-strutted VIP parties in the hills, Sims can now have it all, said Grant, senior producer. The development team has added a slew of fun, humorous, and lavish gameplay content to ensure that fans and their Sims can experience the luxury lifestyle as they play with life, this time in the spotlight. Fans in The Sims 4 Get Famous should be on the lookout for a simified version of a real-life musician and social media star Baby Ariel, whose rise to fame with popular vocal performances on social media can now be emulated by players worldwide. Catch the singer of the hit song Awe performing a song in Simlish in public spaces or strutting down Starlight Boulevard in the glitzy new world of Del Sol Valley. Want a sneak peek at Baby Ariel in The Sims 4 Get Famous? Tune in to The Today Show on NBC see on October 11th at 10 a.m. Eastern time to hear the latest. That's really nice. So it sounds like they have like some type of sponsorship or some type of partnership with a real life musician that's actually going to perform one of her songs in Simlish. That's really nice. I'm glad that they're really connecting with the music world in that aspect. That's awesome. 
I'm thrilled to be partnering with The Sims 4 Get Famous, where players can follow their dreams of making it big as their Sims skyrocket to fame, said Baby Ariel. Over the past few months, I've worked closely with the development team as we crafted my Sim, and I can't wait for my fans to meet me in-game along their ride to stardom. That's really cool. So she's actually in the game, I guess, which is really neat. And you know what this really reminds me of? This reminds me of The Sims 3 Showtime Katy Perry Collector's Edition, because I'm pretty sure Katy Perry had a Sim in-game, and they also had some sort of sponsorship deal with Katy Perry because I did hear her music in the game in Simlish as well so there's probably a little sponsorship deal going on with this and I can see the similarities but I'm glad that they do that I think it's really awesome and to wrap things up they post the Sims 4 Get Famous also introduces the dazzling world of Del Sol Valley Sims can move into a starter home in Mirage Park or hustle and work the way up to a glamorous mansion in the hills of the Pinnacles while exploring all Del Sol Valley has to offer Sims can show off their chic style and don trendy streetwear in a city or designer threads on set. At home, Sims can decorate their expansive dwelling with glittering over-the-top accessories like gold-plated furniture. Sims can even take home a unique set piece to put on display, immortalizing their fame forever. In The Sims 4 Get Famous, only the most prestigious Sims will be able to turn their 15 minutes of fame into a lifetime legacy with a spot on the legendary Starlight Boulevard. That is so cool, guys. And I did notice a lot of similarities with this press release versus the actual Get Famous blog post, but there were still some new points made in this one that I'm very, very excited about. Let me know down in the comment section below, what features are you most excited about? Do you have any concerns with this expansion? Are there features that you were really hoping for that are not in it? For me, I can honestly say I was really hoping for singing, but I'm pretty sure that there are ways to tie other current careers into fame. So maybe there is a way that we can be a famous singer for that matter, but I'm not sure. Let me know what you guys think. Leave all your questions, comments, and concerns down below. I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video, and if you did, be sure to give it a huge thumbs up and add it to your favorites. Subscribe to become a Pixelator today, and ding the little bell next to the subscribe button to be notified of any new upload. Don't forget to follow me on social media. That includes Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, Google+, Twitch, and much more. I love you guys so, so, so much. Thanks for watching, and I can't wait to see you all in my next video. Bye, everybody.